Hey guys, Britt from Agi Images here. Today we're going to talk about some Matterport tips, specifically Matter tags, and how you can use them to embed a lot of information into your tours. Let's dive in. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to pull up your Matterport account. And in here, when you're looking at all of your uh, different Matterport scans that you have, obviously we're going to want to click on the scan that we want to manipulate. When you've selected the scan that you want to make adjustments to, hit the edit button. And after it's done loading, on the right hand side, you're going to see a lot of icons. These are really the icons that we want to focus on when we're editing anything in our tour. Um, you can kind of manipulate anything from your start location to um, if you want to eliminate some scans, which we'll talk about in other videos. But today we want to go down to the icon that looks like a bullseye and click on that because that's going to be our matter tags. So you can see on the right hand side here, it, it pops up uh, each floor level. So if you, if you kind of expand those arrows, it will show you what matter tags are currently in the scan and if they're visible or not. So you can see this one right in front of me. Uh, I can make it visible or not. So um, what I want to do um, is I want to come over to our floor plan and I want to jump into our kitchen because that's where I want to put my matter tags. All right, so we're in the kitchen here and I want to add a matter tag to my listing that shows what countertops we were using or, or that were installed in this house. So I'm going to hit my plus sign and drag my matter tag to wherever I kind of want this to be embedded into the tour. I don't want people to miss it, so I'm gonna put it right here in the center. Now, you can embed three major things um, into a matter tag. Number one is going to be a link. So a link to any kind of website that you wanna take them to. Number two is just basic text. So you can embed things like price, item descriptions, things like that. And number three is a video. So what we're going to talk about first is uh, we're going to talk about the link. So right here, I'm going to put countertops. Um, and then if you click this icon right here, the link icon, it's going to take me to uh, the description. So obviously I can add text to describe what this link is going to be. Um, you guys can add whatever you want. I've pulled up an example of a granite that I would like to feature. So I'm going to put that in here and then I'm going to hit apply. Uh, one other thing that you can do with your matter tags is you can adjust the color. So I, I like to use this feature a lot. It's specifically when I'm talking about products. If we're talking about, you know, granites, linking them together, quartz, countertops, uh, or just specific things that have things in common. And I'll, I'll show you kind of at the end how it's also important to use um, coloring. But right now we're just going to leave it the regular blue. And then you can also adjust the stem size. So from here, you can see my, my little matter tag is getting um, higher, lower, or you can just say, hey, I don't want to stem in general. Okay, so I've got that matter tag, so I'm gonna hit done. Now, I want to add a second matter tag um, near the lake, just to kind of show people like the benefits of being on this specific lake, which is Lake Lanier. So we're gonna go to our floor plan. Uh, I'm gonna pick uh, maybe here down by the dock uh, down here. And you can see I already have a matter tag here talking about the a specific lake. So, you know, I'm going to add another one, um, maybe closer to the dock that they'll see. And then from here, you want to click on your, your media, which is going to be your link to your video. So we're going to, just going to talk about uh, cool on the water. And I'm going to go over to this video that I've pulled up that talks specifically about Lake Lanier. And I'm going to add it into my media link. So you can see right when I load that, now this video loads and it's gonna show up as just kind of like a small video in the uh, matter tag, but you can obviously expand that to a full screen. So I'm gonna hit done. Now when I come over to my matter tag section on the right hand side, you can see that the two that I have added are now visible and they're color coded. So what's nice about this is now if I want to go back to, let's say, the one, the kitchen one and the countertops, I can click on it and it will immediately take me to that matter tag um, over there in the kitchen. So matter tags are, are a really, really great way to add um, content to your tours and just to provide people with more information. 
Another really cool thing that Matter tags can do is they can link you to an additional Matterport scan. So let's say for new construction or a commercial property, if you have multiple properties, you can compare like aspects of the property. So the kitchens, the dining areas, things like that. In this particular example, I want to use uh, the master bathroom. So that's what I'm going to compare. So I'm going to come to the master bathroom um, in my tour that I'm looking at. So here's the master bathroom here. And then what you want to do is in another tab, you want to pull up your Matterport account. And then you want to click on the property that you want to pull from. So here I want to pull from this account. I'm going to hit the edit button again. And then we're going to go over to the master bathroom for this property, just so that way we have a, a good comparison. Okay, so now I'm in the master bathroom for this specific tour that I want to embed into my other tour. Now, you could just use the main link for Matterport, but it is going to take you to the start location. So if that's in the kitchen or something else, it might not be easy to kind of make that connection that you want to link the kitchens. So what you do is when you're in the edit function, you can hit command U and it will pull up a link for this specific angle uh, and location in the Matterport tour. So that's a really awesome feature because now you can link kitchens and kitchens together. So we're gonna hit copy to clipboard and then we're gonna go back to my Matterport tour. In here, I'm gonna add another matter tag and I'm gonna say second bathroom example. So again, if you're using this for granite countertops or just examples of, of specific layouts, this is a really, really great uh, feature. So in here, we're gonna add our little Matterport link, hit apply and done. And now when I click this link, it's gonna take me specifically to that location, to that master bathroom location that we had, we picked uh, for the tour. So, so like I said before, matter tags are a super great way to embed a lot of information into your tours. I highly recommend that you take the time to use them. They're very easy to change. As you can see, we just made lots of adjustments in, in under five minutes. Thanks for watching. Uh, we are Agi Images. And if we can help you guys with anything else, make sure to comment below or reach out to us at agiimages.com. Thanks.